The blue Danube, meandering from west to east, nourishes and bears witness to the civilization and prosperity of Europe. More than 40 kilometers southeast of Belgrade, the capital of Serbia, at the confluence of the Danube and Morava rivers, there's a small city with a population of more than 100,000, Smederevo. Founded in 1913, the Smederevo steel mill contributed 40% of the city's revenue at its peak and is known as the pride of Serbia. Later, due to intensified market competition and poor management, the century-old steel mill began to lose money year after year and was on the verge of bankruptcy. The government of Serbia organized several rounds of international tenders to sell off the plant, all of which failed. It was a big pressure, not only for management, but it was a big pressure for people, because they didn't know what is coming tomorrow. Vladan Aleksic had worked in the Serbian steel mill for 30 years. It was a place to which he was emotionally attached and also a means of living for his family. In April 2016, as more than 5,000 employees were left helpless, the HBIS group from China invested in the establishment of HBIS Serbia Steel. When he first arrived in Serbia, Song Sihai saw that the steel mill equipment was old and the production line had almost ground to a halt. Could the arrival of the Chinese company really save the Serbian steel plant on the verge of bankruptcy? Just two months after the establishment of HBIS Serbia Steel, on June 19, 2016, this century-old steel mill welcomed an important guest. On this day, thousands of steel mill workers, their families, and residents of Smederevo gathered at the factory to welcome the arrival of Chinese President Xi Jinping. President Xi Jinping delivered an enthusiastic speech. He pointed out that the cooperation between Chinese and Serbian enterprises had opened a new chapter in production capacity cooperation between the two countries. There was good reason to believe that close cooperation between the two sides would help the Smederevo steel mill regain its vitality, increase local employment, improve people's living standards, and promote Serbia's economic development. Svi su znali. da nakon govora predsjednika Xi Jinpinga da dolazi nova budućnost za železaru Smederevo. Ja sam imao veliku privilegiju i zadovoljstvo da prisustvujem tom razgovoru i kasnije da pokažem predsjedniku Xi Jinpingu naša postrojenja u toploj valjonici i imao sam priliku da provedem nekoliko trenutaka u srdačnom razgovoru sa predsjednikom. In the steel mill's staff cafeteria, President Xi sat down and chatted briskly with the workers. Here, President Xi received a gift made by the steel mill workers, a commemorative plaque of the Smederevo steel mill. Visoke peći dva, visoke peći jedan. Predsjednik Si je bio veoma zadovoljan, ja bih rekao bio je iznenađen, jer je ta kovanica predstavljala siluetu železare na prvom gvožđu koje je odliveno na prvoj visokoj peći u Smederevu 1971. Ja sam mu objasnio šta predstavlja taj novac i bio je veoma srećan i zadovoljan sa poklonom koju smo mu priredili. This plaque, forged from steel, has now become a testament to the friendship between China and Serbia. It also bears witness to the story of a century-old steel plant's revival under the Belt and Road Initiative. Xi Jinping's arrival, ah, not only was for the Chinese government to strengthen our confidence in the Western world.
The Chinese team brought advanced management and technology to transform the steel mill into a global enterprise in terms of clients and the supply chain. And at the end of 2016, just eight months after HBIS took over, the steel mill turned a profit. HBIS Serbian Steel invested several hundred million yuan, tore down the outdated buildings and equipment, introduced a slew of advanced global technologies and techniques, and ensured that the steel plants, energy conservation, environmental protection, and green manufacturing practices meet leading European standards. HBIS Serbian Steel takes active part in the construction of the Belt and Road Initiative and the process of economic globalization, quickly becoming a highly competitive steel enterprise in Europe and a model for international industrial cooperation. The revival of a century-old steel plant also rejuvenates the city. Now in Smedorevo, 20,000 people have jobs related to the steel plant. The unemployment rate has dropped from 18% to 6%. The birth rate ranks high in Serbia, and physical revenue has more than doubled. U svakom slučaju Smederevo je Smederevo je danas znatno bolje mesto za život nego što je to bilo ranije. U Evropi i još jednom velika zahvalnost kineskom predsjedniku i kineskom narodu za sve što je radio. U 21 sat kada ćemo ovo da otvorimo za putnički saobraćaj. Da se zahvalim predsjedniku Siju što je uvek bio u Srbiju jer da nismo imali vašu podršku i pomoć I na istoku Srbije u boru stopu BDP-a i da li bismo, koliko bismo finansijski krvarili, da li bismo mogli da gradimo veliko puteva. Driven by the Belt and Road Initiative, China-Serbia collaboration has borne rich fruit. Serbia's economic growth rate has been at the forefront in Europe for several years. For the local people, the Belt and Road means roads and bridges, a bond of friendship and a promising future.